Hey everybody, this is Grace. In this video, I want to talk about a narcissistic behavior and um, just because they have the a person has the behavior doesn't make them narcissist have that personality disorder, narcissistic personality disorder. And just because they have narcissistic personality disorder they doesn't mean that they have this one. Well, I think they do, <laughs> this one. But uh, it's a lack of empathy for others. You know, they might not even recognize or care about the other person's um, what happens to what's going on with the other person happening to them whatever um, they lack empathy okay okay now to me lack of when you use the word lack that does not mean zero okay doesn't necessarily mean zero and that it, it doesn't say they have absolutely no empathy for anybody else it says lack of Okay, now I'm going to give my personal, ex something from my personal experiences, uh, the way I see it, um, could be wrong, but I have seen people who have kind of like narcissistic behaviors, but they do feel empathy, exhibit empathy, but it's for certain people, and that would be um, like the narcissistic parent, the parent that has narcissistic behaviors, or um, a sibling, and or both. That's weird. Okay, just a little um, squirrel moment here. They pulled in the wrong direction, dropped the, the car in front of me, dropped off that guy. I thought, I hope he doesn't work there. <laughs> but yeah. Anyway, so it was kind of a little bit on the strange side. That's just a little nothing big. <clears throat> but pulling in in the wrong direction, yeah, that, that's something people don't usually do there. But anyway, so where was I? About, um, you know, this kind of behavior. Okay, and what I've seen is that they usually have some kind of empathy toward, like I said, that that's the important person in their life. The, you know, the one that had the, showed the behavior or taught them the behavior, something, or had it while they were growing up. Okay, that's, that's been my experience with what I've seen with people that had those kinds of behaviors. It, the narcissistic type of behaviors and the histrionic. Now, some might say that that's borderline, uh, that what I saw was borderline, someone with borderline personality disorder. I know two were diagnosed with borderline personality disorder. So, yeah, it could be that. And, but it, there is that empathy there for that person, but nobody else. Because what I've seen is that they feel that if it's not about them, it doesn't matter. Or that um, parent or you know, and or sibling, they only matter. See? Okay, but that could be because they they seem to think that this other, you know, the parent or the uh, sibling both are like extensions of them that the society sees them as all the same you know because they are family so they have that for that family member you know some kind of admiration even for the other family with you know family member or members and uh, but not every family member you know just the ones that have the same similar kind of traits of behaviors Okay, another thing I've seen is that they have uh, that they have some kind of empathy for animals, you know, like their pets or somebody else's pet. Uh, now, some would say that no, they do not experience any empathy whatsoever for anybody or anything, and anybody's a fool if they think that they do. I don't, I don't agree. One size doesn't fit all. I really don't. And like I said, lack of doesn't mean zero. Okay, none, nil, zilch doesn't mean that. It's a lack of, at least in my book it does, I don't know, maybe it's different to other people, or maybe I'm reading it wrong, but <laughs> hey, you know, I'm talking my book, and, I mean, in my mind, but yeah, so anyway, what, what is your view? Do you believe lack of means, I've, I've not done a video about this before, but do you think it means none, or just maybe for some and the other ones it doesn't matter because it's not about them, therefore it doesn't matter, anyway. Or what is your view? Leave a comment below. 
If you want to subscribe to this channel, click the circle. If you want to watch another video on this channel, click one of the rectangles. Like, subscribe, comment, share if you would, and I'll talk to you all in another video. Bye.